my name is Liam O'Sullivan. I'm the head of Capital Programme Delivery for UK Power Networks. Uh, we're here today. This is day one of our Leicester Square investment project. Beneath our feet, you've got an electricity substation. Uh, the transformers are coming to their end of life, so I need to replace them to maintain reliability to the current network. It's going to take us approximately two years to replace each of the three transformers. They're going to be done consecutively. Those three transformers basically are coming to the end of their useful life. They've worked really hard for us. They've provided heat, power, wealth and light for 30 odd years. Now it's our chance to replace them. So the key stages of the project are, number one, we establish a site compound for our work. We then take up the ground above the transformer we're working on. We take the transformer out of the ground. We prepare the bay for the new transformer. We bring the new transformer in. We couple it up electrically. We reinstate the ground. Then we energize that new transformer. And we then reinstate the ground fully above. We do that three times for the three transformers. We then take away our site establishment and we return the square to the state that it was in before we started work. Today we're actually just setting up site, getting on with putting the hoarding in place, tree protection and uh, getting ready for the site accommodation to come in. We've established a site perimeter, um, three metres high of a hoarding uh, with double gates, access and an escape route. So our site is very secure. We have a 24-7 security patrol on site and attendance. We have CCTV cameras and we have a three metre high hoarding to segregate the work and public areas. We then installed our cell web, which is to protect the tree roots below. I'm the agricultural consultant here, supervising any uh, work around the trees, protecting the trees, making sure that the trees don't get any damage. So we've had a good day here today, a lot of progress has been made. We've installed the new temporary ticket office and hopefully when the theatres open they'll be ready to sell tickets. We're just going to piece up the hoarding now so it's all secure for the weekend and let's all have a happy Friday. So we started in November 2020, uh, the site has been set up. We're now going to move on with the groundworks which will enable us to remove the transformers. The team are working on the area above transformer number three. We're removing the block paving that's in situ at the moment. Each block is numbered and recorded on this chart here. So they're identified on here and we know exactly where they've come from and exactly where they go back after the work's been completed. So uh, you can rest assured that when we leave the square, it will look exactly like it did before we came. We carried out a detailed survey of all of the blocks and, and all of the, the equipment within the square and the benches and we'll be leaving them exactly like we found them. We're at Leicester Square. Uh, the goal of today was to remove, start removing the concrete beams above the transformer bay in the substation in order for us to get access to the transformer and start the process of removing the old one and installing the new one. We've been working with Westminster City Council, the Heart of London Business Alliance, the local businesses and the local community uh, to develop the concept for the hoarding and the wrap and the colour and the, and the theme that will, um, that will soon be up behind me. It was very important for us to um, ensure that Leicester Square looked like it was open for business uh, and still trading throughout the uh, the, the, the time that the UK Power Networks uh, project was taking place and I think that's been really successfully done at the level of investment and time and effort that's gone into um, making sure the hoardings look great uh, in it. It's been a fantastic result. We're here for around two years now so um, we wanted to celebrate where we are with this beautiful hoarding graphic design that we have installed. Well, I'm thrilled that because of this um, partnership, we've been able to actually finally make it into the actual Leicester Square Gardens. So we are going to be opening a temporary structure just behind me in the heart of Leicester Square opposite the fountain. I think what's brilliant in its bold colours, in its messaging, it really encapsulates all the different stories and all the different businesses that are happening in the heart of Leicester Square. And I think all of this is powered by UK Panex, it's powered by electricity, it's powered by these transformers. Fact that uh, lighting has been incorporated into the design as well so it doesn't disappear at night it's a it's a real focal point for the square 
UK Power Networks has been working hand in hand with Heart of London Business Alliance to plan around the business needs from the very outset. It combines and fuses the two things that this project stands for and it stands for recharging and powering up Leicester Square and Leicester Square's identity which is film, theatre, entertainment, hospitality. The impact our new substation will have on London and its interconnected electricity network will be immense, leaving a legacy that lasts for generations to come.